Hey everybody out there on YouTube, this is Chris Nicholson. Right now what I'm showing you, this is the piano that was in my bedroom. Uh, this is the Yamaha Grand. It's hard to see it because of the light, and I got a cheap camera. But um, this is an old DG2, and this is a 5 foot 8. The reason the piano is out in the living room right now is because I got a new piano, which I'm going to show you. As you can see, I have a lot of pianos here. This over here, this is my new baby. This is a Young Chang 7 foot. The model number on it is a G123. And you won't believe it. I got this piano for free. Um, the reason of that is because it was fully, fully vandalized and damaged. And so it was in a piano warehouse an old piano warehouse all the way in the back and it was up against a whole bunch of other pianos that were going to be thrown out um, later on I'll show you pictures of what it used to look like right now I'm going to open it up so you can see by the way I got more keyboards if you can see right here that's a Yamaha PSR 6700 this over here that is a Roland BK5 and I just got this yesterday for free. This is a um, Casio WK1350. Uh, you know what about the Casios is that it has better rhythms than the newer ones. The older ones have a lot better rhythms than the newer ones. So, now you can see it. It doesn't look like it's been damaged at all or anything like that. But when I first got it, Everything that you could think of living in the piano was in there. There was a rat's nest, roach nest, lizard nest, mice. I meant anything you you can name it. This piano also had termites to the bottom board. You know, right by right by the legs. It had a bottom board. It had it had uh, termites in there. So I got it fumigated. I got the wood retreated, refilled. Um, all these strings in here I redid myself. That was, um, this is actually the fourth time I had to restring a piano fully. The first time was not easy, but this is the fourth time. And I did all the strings myself. Um, I'm still working, you know, on replacing the dampers. So that's all I have to do. I have to get new damper felts for it. But all the new strings, it's, all the strings are brand spanking new. The soundboard has been re-cleaned. It didn't even need refinishing. This is actually a brand new piano. And we go to the front here. And here it is. This is the Young Shang. I don't know if you can actually see the model number. It's a G213 7 foot grand piano. Alright, well, let me stop yapping and let me uh, play this piano for you. I think you're going to like the sound of it. Um, according to where I could put the camera at in my in my room, it is uh, going to be hard to get a full shot of this piano. So here we go. I don't know if you guys can see me, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to take off the uh, the music rest right here. You know, this is the little music stand. I'm going to actually take this off, put this aside, and then. You can actually see the full insides. Before I play the piano, I just wanted to show you guys again all the pins that I did the work on. There's one pin right over here. It actually snapped. So I'm getting another technician to help me um, work on that. But these are brand new stainless steel pins. And it gave me the high quality strings that have extra polish so it will not rust. So that is really good. Here's the keys. You know, it's a damn shame what people do to these pianos because sometimes they have a really good instrument and they cannot actually enjoy it. So I'm putting this on a stand. I'm going to play it for you. I hope you can see me. I was 
very, very optimistic about this piano because, you know, I never worked on a full-size, uh, actually, seven-foot concert grand before. I always worked on the little baby grands and as in restringing. Uh, here's the sound of it. From the bass... stretching and it's acclimating around to my room. Uh, another thing about this piano is that I had to make the trap work. The original lyre on this piano is from a kawaii piano, so it didn't match up with the trap work. And the legs are from another piano too. Um, when this piano was in the warehouse, this piano just basically wasn't get, getting taken care of or anything. It has a hole on the bottom of it for the player system, so I took the player system out of it. I'm going to replace it with a new one later. But not bad for um, a free piano. Well, it was free given to me, but as a materials, already it cost me around $500 in worth of materials. Um, it was worth it. Ragtime boogie woogie. So if I'm playing something really fast, I have to stop what I'm doing and control the right section. Um, Re-regulated. Right now, it kind of still feels a little more spongy. I want to get it more re-regulated, like, like like my Yamaha piano. Um, the bench. This is an actual Young Chang bench. Um, it's hard to see it from here, but it's a concert bench that raises up and down. Um, so, what do you think, you two? You guys like my piano? I couldn't believe that I got this for free. Not only I got this piano for free, but I got like four other ones. There's another seven footer that they gave me for free that actually infected this one. Um, and we just trashed it because it was not even worth saving. Except for some of the parts we took out, like the egg rafts and everything. But everything on this piano is back to normal. As I said, it had whatever was living in there is dead. I took it to a termite vault and basically it killed everything. So write me back YouTube. Thank you very much. <laughs>